might might be Easter holidays, but a man who repairs goes mad if he doesn't repair something every day. Now, uh, the chief that came from uh, Birmingham way, uh, basically, I've got a headline for it. And it's the uh, infrared one. Yeehaw! And then all I really need is, um, uh, I think these ones here should have an outer lens in front of the bulb. Something's not right. I haven't really investigated it. But um, at least I won't have um, a busted one, because they do look rough when they're busted. And uh, these uh, screws do seem to be uh, loose, so that's quite handy. And they're definitely coming apart. Um, you remind me of someone, I'm not quite sure who. It's the moustache that does it. And the haircut, to be honest. Yes, if your hair goes a bit darker as you get older and your eyes stay blue, you could be a bit of a spitting image of all the things you could do at Tank Slot and uh, you want to play in a tank track. And uh, there's a lot of them. So uh, um, the wettest bit and waded across. And I'm not in New Wellington, so I've given the job to the boss, who is in the Wellingtons, but undoubtedly leak, because all Wellingtons leak. It's kind of a design feature. The more you pay, the more they're going to leak. Strange, but true. One of life's mysteries. There's something about a fire and having a good old clear up and rooting through all the old crap and chucking it through and all this old stuff here. And just keep it, oh yeah, what have we got there? Look, like, intimate. Lee Beckham shower, shower gel. I'm having that. Quite heavy. Well, hey, it's my lucky day. I can wash today and smell like David Beckham. Is you good in there, Jackson? I know a little boy who wants to watch a cowboy. He wants to watch a cowboy with his daddy. A diddly 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 do. Diddly 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 bumpy 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 boo. He wants to watch a cowboy. He's really 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 wants to watch a cowboy with his daddy on Easter Sunday. Diddly 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 do. Bobbity bobbity bobbity. You pretended to be asleep. Are you just pretending? Uh, yubbity bobbity 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 biddly biddly boo diddly 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 do. Daddy's getting quite annoying. Diddly 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 do. Bobbity 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 bob. Diddly 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 do. You a bit tired? Uh, diddly 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 dee John Wayne, John Wayne, John Wayne. You want to watch a cowboy? I can tell. Maybe not. The thing that really pisses you off is when a low loader brings you two vehicles when he could have fitted three on. That is just laziness. Why, why is it just two on there? Okay. Why do you only put two on? I've got ten there. Why bring two? Unbloody believable. Now I saw this thing pop up on um, a Facebook page a couple of days ago. And uh, yeah. Yeah, I forget who it is. Oh, some bunch up in Manchester, I think. They looked after it. It's a good old girl, but we use it as a cupboard at the moment um, for all Kate's eBay stuff. But uh, yes, it'll be back on the road soon. Tomorrow we have a funeral in, um, oh crikey, Dorset. Long way, three and a half, four hours. And um, I've had my hair cut, so I'm kind of halfway there. And they specially cut out all the grey and left the blonde, which I was cool, cool with that. And um, the lads are, um, oh, here we go. Ashley's looking busy. He's still flat out on the scimitars as hard as he can. That one looks like it loose. These headlights. Oh no, not the Range Rover. Well, it sounds nice. A lot of leaves on the back of it. That's been sitting a while. In fact, I think that was one that was sitting right down the bottom of the bloody field. Just goes to show you can wake them up and they go great. Yeah, it looks nice. Look at those shitty rubies, not like the ones I get. Look at that, look. The red one looks orange. The orange one looks red. It looks like they painted the inside. But when I look at this, I look at the um, exhaust cover and I look at a few other little telltale things and I look at the road wheels and the spare... Oh, it needs top hats on the... Um, it needs some top hats on the final drives. What's the miles on it? I'm thinking 400. Just looking at damage and bits and pieces. 3619. 3619. What, 3,600? 3, wow, that's a lot. Tell you what, that's been looked after to look that tidy. 
with that sort of mileage, the Cummins can handle it, but it's probably had four gearboxes in that time. So all we need is um, a couple of headlights and some mirrors and a bit of a tidy. gear change. Now I saw they had all the um, all the steering out and the brakes out earlier, um, honing that and putting in seals in, so that's obviously worked nicely. Make some of the very nice brakes. I think, I think that one's done. Finally done. And now this one in here, this is a Samaritan. And uh, I'll tell you what, making a mess of that, isn't it? We're going to need some concrete. Yes. This one here is a Samaritan. Now, I've, had, I've got two Samaritans. These are the ambulance versions. And um, it's kind of really sad because when all this first kicked off, the first vehicles everybody wanted were Samaritans. Obviously, ambulances. Um, but we started converting the Sultan so you could get a lot of seats inside. And um, 150 CVRTs later, we've still got two Samaritans. Um, Samaritan sitting in the yard and uh, basically uh, reading a bit between the eye, uh, lines and what people have told me is if you're bad enough to need an ambulance it's unlikely you're going to make it anyway so they give you a cigarette and um, they take the people who have got lesser injuries and stuff them in the back of a sultan and uh, that's why the Samaritans are still here so there you go proof of the pudding is in what they want this one down here is, I think, finished now as well. This is quite a nice Spartan. Nice one, isn't it, Biggie? Hey, you'd like this one. Yeah, this is quite a nice Spartan. A lot of work went into that one. Um, we had to swap a lot of road wheels. And um, strangely, I've got road wheels on eBay at 135 pound. Luckily, no one buys them because um, they cost me about 220 pounds each to have them re-rubbered. So I'm hardly likely to sell them at 135. But uh, I must change that listing. Yes, it's a different world now. And when you want rubber, um, I had one quote off a guy and he wanted 555 pounds per road wheel on a 432. Yeah, and he wasn't dreaming. He was dreaming if he thought he was gonna get the business, but uh, that was his quote. Apparently they're putting in a different chemical because of the ecological thing. And um, and that's making it more expensive. You right, Mike? I am good. Did you do that little bit on that bin box up there? Yes. You've done that bit. Well there done, mate. A couple of little bits on it. Okay. Well, I reckon this is probably ready for paint, don't you? Probably ready for paint. Got our special periscope system. 